Dude, axe on one is disgusting. It's good you just need stamina. That's not good. And a spike shield. Okay. Pretty good start, I would say. Axe on one with spike shield. Fuck yes. Backpack triggers battle rage. So items inside go faster for 30% for 5 seconds and I take 20% less damage or something. Yeah. Probably just bronze players, honestly. So we can just run single axe for a while. You don't really need to do double weapon or focus on whetstones or anything like that. No reason to roll. This looks good. I think we're just shilling. Like this opener, <laughs> triple ping. This opener should be insane. Oh. Hungry herb. Sheesh. Are you even crits? There's two class items that help with it. Actually, three class items, right? Go for speed already? Hell yes. Oh, look at his positioning. Actual arts, if I may say so myself. So I'm definitely taking the other class item, yep. Hmm. Shovel on Pyro, uh, on um, Berserker. Hmm. Speed, stamina will be good as well, but I, I, we might get this already, right? I can greed, so sure. Uh, how do I see both like this? Yes, like that. You have the new bow. Very standard. It almost looked like I could lose this. Um, my axe at 59. Keep buying more fannies? Sure. Is this game 18 plus? I don't think so, no. This thing is not that good, right? Where is the shield island? Right, I forgot. This guy has to be in Narnia. There we go. Pocket sand probably more valuable. So this wants to be upgraded as well. <sighs> like this, banana not in duffel bag. Is that okay? This thing has to be weird for a round. I think that's okay. We'll solve it later. Sure. Sure, sure. Was fun? Yeah, I'm having fun as well. I'm trying Buster Blade this game. Um, we've also had some fun games. We're making Chili Goober double Burning Torch. To be honest, I've seen a lot of Pyros go double Burning Torch over the Burning Blade, which I think is a lot better, right? Because it scales your heat. I would... I I'm gonna try Pyro next game. I think I'm just building uh, the blade. Big. So I think if you're playing for a ranking up, you just make this thing and just spam it. But I'm going for the bust the blade. So the boots would they help me? Not really. Roll without boxing. The armor always helps. This thing is just nasty. So position goes back to what it was, which is like... This. And then I'll put... Oh, feel good. This here. 
How is the real version? I'm so pumped to play it in the afternoon. It's fun. Uh, I think what the most fun thing is, is uh, variety. Like, not everyone is just spamming or going to be spamming the same balls because there's so many classes. To be fair, most people are playing Berserker or um, Pyromancer, so you're going to see mostly that. But I think over the coming weeks, as soon as people all... Um, like, experiment more and go back to Ranger and Reaper, maybe then the end game will be super fun to play and also there's so many extra items now it's harder to force stuff it's super hard to force things because there's just more things in the shop right oh dragons yo gives a free months to carlos thank you so much dude thank you for the free months gift sub uh it's very kind thank you and carlos hope you enjoy the emotes man and uh the sub edge so what's more we go pyro with a double whip maybe Ooh, I like this. <laughs> More glove? Uh, do I just keep spamming gloves until I hit the fucking thing? I had one more, one more, and then I call it. <laughs> then I call it quits. Sure. And I'll just get space for later. Very greedy, but I think I can afford to right now. Hmm, double tusk poker. Another plat card gamer. Hmm. Ready to nerf double X? The thing is basically unstoppable. I think it is stoppable. It's you can counter it, but people are not really gonna bother because they wanna play their own bills right now. So if something is giga strong, it'll probably be strong for a while until people are realizing, okay, maybe I should be buying caps, you know? That's good against it. Or stim them out faster. I have no stamina, like, pretty much. And I'm missing one. One hit and they're dead? Nice. Got them. So, I think it's Knuckle. I played Shaman last time, I got offered like one or two runes and they were really bad. I only took this because I wanted the Hawk, but it's a legendary. Like, they just, they show up so little in the shop, I feel like. And the random buffs weren't that great either. This is consistent crit. This needs wolves and pets to crit, so I think it's just brass knuckles. Yeah. Yeah, the runes are really good, they're just super hard to find, which I cannot really rely on, I feel like. So we're just looking for Busted Blade. That's it. And survival items. Yeah, I could put yellow backpack, or uh, yellow in backpack, right? First summon them. Cheese, nah. Stamina potion is good. More fanny on sale, sure. Do we want knuckles sped up with the fanny and in here? I mean, that's not both possible, so I guess it's just here. I can actually have. Wait, wait, there was some god positioning, I remember. Let's do the god positioning again. This goes here. This has to go like. Wait, no, that to go here, here. But yeah, I think this is the positioning because then you can glove both this and this. But then it's not in backpack, right? Wait, how did I do this again? Yeah, there was. This needs to be vertical. Right, right, right. This to be vertical, knuckle in the middle. That's how it was done. Yep. And then you can do it. And then this can go here and it's also knuckled. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So, the, the most interesting thing, I think, is we'll have to learn a lot of patterns again. Like, with Ranger and Reaper, I kind of know if you have Poison Flask, you do this. If you have Arrow and these items, you do this, right? Like, Ripsaw, Double Bow, Goobert, I know how to position that. Um, but now, with all of these new setups, like, for example, now I know kind of how to do Brass Knuckles, Axe, Dragon Claws. Like, it's this setup. I just gotta remember this. And there'll be a lot of other setups that I've never seen that I'll have to remember. I think that's cool. I think it's cool that we are trying to learn this and pioneer stuff, right? That's when I have most fun in the game. I can maybe put the yellow gem in now. I don't have any stamina sex yet, though. Alright, okay, let's play safe. I have too much space, that's for sure. This does not have a gem slot in it. Hmm.
Mm-mm. They have the flame web, they got 22 heats. I did some out eventually, okay. But this works. The damage DPS right now is 13. I will need a, a colors to extend my battle reach as well. There we have it. Buster Blade around 9. Big. So, time to reposition again. Um, I don't want to speed the knuckles still, but then it doesn't see the sword, which obviously is super important, so we call it. I mean, I could do this. Because knuckles... Oh, no, no. So we only have one armor at like a second. I guess this also needs to point there still. I still have enough space. I think you can put speed on. Probably not actually. So many gems though. I will combine. Um, That's it. So this round I'll probably lose, but that's fine. You see YouTube volume, now Ben's voice is busting my ears. What do you mean? The Pyro's Goob, yeah, it's a Goob Chili. Yeah, it's Goob Chili, and now you have uh, Chili Goob. They're playing the Whip, so they remove all my buffs and gain damage from it instead. Yeah, it only needing one. We just them out, we're not even in um, Battle Rage yet. I just need a stamina sec, honestly. One hit and they're probably dead. Nice. So we actually did not lose this. We now have the Buster Blade. <laughs> Which is fucking massive. It's so insane. Um, okay. Plan is simple now. It's not bad. We just want defenses, we want stamina and speed. This goes here, this goes here. I don't think I just locked this though. Because stamina is still important, right? I should lock a uh, roll with the box in. A cap maybe? Cap with a comfort would be nice. Or a stone cap. Uh what does stone cap do again? Um, reduce damage is whatever because I want to hit battle rage, but it's mainly it prevents crits and it prevents stuns. I think it's worth. Oh, it's very expensive though, but I do still think it's worth. Still value the stamina at the moment. Put all the other gems in here. I will combine, I guess. Stone Gloves OP, just because it gets more... Right, we could actually do Stone Gloves as well. It gets more damage, right? Triple Baby Bowl. Red Clover. Nice. Red Battle Rage and then just one-shot them with the crit, okay. We can also make Cap of Discomfort. Oh, is that better? I think that's still better. It's, it doesn't block crits and stuff, but it nullifies buffs and reduces healing. Actually, is that better? Yes, because I don't value the armor gain. This is mainly the crits. Yeah, I know. I do think I prefer that. It's a very slow turn, though, I feel like. Also, I should not have combined that gem, I just realized. I should not have done that. But yeah, if we make the stone gloves, we get plus 20% damage, but we go 10% slower. Plus 20% damage is a lot. Basically, it's a giga whetstone. It's plus 10 damage whetstone, but 10% slower. Is that worth it? Plus da 10 damage. About, right? I think that's not bad, but I don't think we go for that here. Also, yeah, it should go into the blade. 
Yeah, this balls did nothing for half the fight until we drop low. That is very true. We're facing a fucking Phoenix. Unlucky. Let's see if you beat it though. And maybe we can actually fit Yellow Gem in here. Okay, Battle Rage has triggered. We still only have 5 seconds of Battle Rage though, which is not a lot. I really need um, the colors. Yeah. Because they just come back to life and I'm dead. There's a lot of things I need right now. Double Buster Blade, it was an option. But not yet, I think. I still need to extend my stupid... Um, Battle Rage. Yeah, I need colors, maybe another armor, but um that's another Phoenix. Do they seem weaker? Oh, and they have the lantern as well. They just keep coming back to life. I hate this so much, man. <sighs> Boots, no relevance. More cap, more speed. No, 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 no. Come on. Stamina is like... Not terrible, but... Um, it's not my priority right now. I'm kind of fine. I just can't find the few items I need. I roll for two gold. Mm. I can roll one more time, right? I think they cost five gold. Oh my god, yes. Big brain. Massive brain. Now we have two more seconds of battle rage. That's kinda kinda nice. Mm. I don't think Apple's a mistake at all. Oh my god, look at this shit. People love playing like trumpet and flute with uh, pyro because you have so much heat that uh, you can make it work pretty well. Like many flames. They're also playing the lantern. How's the balance feeling? Um, well, the, the issue is that you don't see much Reaper or Ranger, so it's hard to compare. You don't see a lot of normal matchups like Bloodborne I haven't seen a single time, so I, it's hard to compare with that. But it feels good. I think the balance feels alright. Definitely some really strong things that feel like they would get nerfed, but yeah. They're still going back to life, right? Oh no. They already did. Okay, we have enough gloves, I think. <laughs> Look, this I could put the yellow one here. I really don't need more space. It's on seal stamina, but yeah. Wolpertinger. Hmm. Yeah, I'm using all my rolls because I want to find more of these. And maybe another armor. There's no reason. Like, yeah, I want to use every roll I have. My coffee is getting cold already. So an armor phoenix as well, bunch of dragons. Mm, so they're well resummoned. Dude, phoenix is so good. You can play it with literally anything, right? 126 crit is big. Oh, I didn't kill? They still need to resummon. Oh no. What? They already did. I keep missing it. Oh, did I kill them when they resummoned? I think I might have overkilled them. Is that how it works? Oh, here. No, no, no. I did kill him here, but he only had 4 heat, so he came back with 40 HP. Okay. That's why I missed it. They had, like, no heat left anyway. Nice. I don't think we stemmed out either, right? But Buster Blade seems... Yeah, compared to the normal Great Sword, I don't know how to feel about it. It's... It feels iffy. Still have 4 more rounds as well. Okay, so we still have a lot of time to improve this. 
Okay, we'll combine this gem then. Sail and sail space again. I'll roll with a box. Box or sail? No. Valor, I think, is fine. Oh, there's the armor. We make the armor first and get the Valor, sure. The positioning has also been a bit scuffed. I've not really been trying to optimize this, I realize. Um, it's all good though. Something like this is fine. A million heat and as many wasps items sounds good for flute trumpet, yeah. What's the blade is just a weaker? The issue is just that, I mean, the benefit is that you don't need an entire empower setup. The downside is that you need to wait until you drop low. Um, to actually get the benefits. Like right now, I still haven't triggered it. But now I did. So now I trigger. Another benefit, I guess, is that um, Battle Rage does trigger auto items. So you have a lot of like sustain with the armor that I'm making. So I drop low, this triggers, and then I get like my armor to trigger. I get these gloves to trigger. So there's other benefits that do come with it. I don't think it's very black and white. They both have upsides and downsides. Maybe there, I'm just missing something. There's maybe a better way to play this still. Although I'm doing pretty well. Uh, I did almost 600 here, 118 crit. How can you get a crit besides Knuckles? So yeah, I use Knuckles here because they feel consistent. They're easy, right? I just play them. Last game, I wanted to do it with uh, Shaman Mask and then find their rune. I'll show you. Um, the Eagle or Hawk rune? I think it's Hawk rune. So putting those in your weapon, you have a lot of slots anyway. You increase crit chance by 15% and crit damage, so you get more damage as well. Issue is I never saw them, <laughs> so it's it didn't feel consistent to get the mask and get these. You can also get crit by playing puppies, like if you play this, so you play pets, you can get a uh, crit chance, but you would need a lot of money for a lot of pets and a lot of space. It's a very big commitment just to get a little bit of crit chance, right? But again, brass knuckles, you just play and slowly builds up crit and you don't have to look at it. It's fine. It even increases the accuracy in case you're facing blind, which is good. And can trigger stuns. So, I think the easiest way if you want to crit with this class would just be playing Knuckles. Um, no. I think they need to increase the odds that with which um, runes show up because it's a... Um, rare? No, it's it's legendaries. And I think it just, like... Whenever a legendary is offered in a shop like Shield of Valor, it just has a chance of being a rune, which is, it's just not good. Right? It's twenty, like in the end, it's twenty percent to maybe get a rune, and even like most of the time, it's not a rune because there's so many items in the game. So yeah, it has just not felt consistent. But Mask, what it also does is convert luck into random buffs. So if you have a build that somehow wants to get random buffs or benefit of buffs, then I think it could be good. I want to touch armors, that's true. True and real. There. I still want more colors, I'm pretty sure. A chili cheese goom? Uh, it's another phoenix. Okay, I'm facing a lot of the same bills right now. A lot of um, phoenix heats. Um, pyromancers. Okay, we're in battle rage. This thing goes insane. 50 DPS, but it also has 40% crit chance. You already resummoned, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. We need one more hit. But we did run out of... Uh, okay, we killed him with the knuckles. <laughs> Actually, big. Um, but we are... Um, Battle Ridge did eventually run out. And we did stem out as well. So one more color would just be massive. We got another stamina potion as well then. It's two more rounds. How have I only seen one, one color? Nobody's playing poison. The green gems are actually not relevant. Still no color. This thing is kind of nice, but uh... banana. Nah, I don't think I find I'm fine not combining. I think. Congrats, thank you. But I I don't think I will do IRL streams now. 
I'm just gonna take Japan to relax, chill, and just, you know, enjoy my stay there. Oh, they're playing four... Wait, they're playing three different gloves here. They're playing the claws of attack for when they go into... Wait, with double cheese goober? Wait, 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 double cheese goober? Double X? Double dragon claws for when they hit battle rage? Claws of power, so it goes a bit slower, but it gets 20% damage bonus. Um, and vamp claws. Holy shit! They also have perfect ruby double crisp. This is sick, man. This looks like a really good setup. They also have two pineapples for some reason. Wait, I like this a lot. Wow, this this seems like it will just be um, kind of the meta for this class, right? I don't think we beat that. We could. We might. We need to wait until we hit Battle Rage, though. Which we're about to hit. Okay, we hit it. The only issue is their Battle Rage. They also take less damage. My crit chance is only 40 still. Like, my crit chance builds very slowly. But I win because they have no stamina. So see, I think this is one of the strongest weapons to build around on Berserker. Uh, I think this is really good. But it's not just an auto win. Like, they didn't have stamina to support it. That's, that's why I won. Right? They just kind of went too all in on to, like, the cheese group stuff. But I think it's an interesting idea. Yeah, yeah. Welcome back, Movzino. Okay, so final thing I need. I'll get a little bit more space. I'll... I just need more colors. Do I roll with the box install? Probably. I wouldn't mind another yellow gem. Another armor. We have no time to combine. Final round, you can also sell the forging hammer. Because it's pretty useless here. Um, There it is. Another color. Maybe some potion. Probably not. Yellow gem. And I'll sell this actually playable and I'll speed it up maybe. It'd be kind of nice. Oh, I can still sell the box as well, right. <laughs> Lots of things I can sell. <sighs> Maybe you're supposed to do double busted sword. That's so much space though. Alright, let's see it. Final version. Just tuned in, how is Japan? I'm still leaving. I'm leaving in three days. Uh, yeah. Another Phoenix Bolt, they have cold with it. Fuck, I have nothing against cold, right? That's why the potion would have been good, maybe, to cleanse debuffs. Yeah, I haven't seen a single Reaper. I've seen a couple of Rangers, but Reaper just sees zero play. Okay, we hit um, Battle Rage. We still have 1.6 cooldown, even with all the heat. They still resummon, I think, or did they already? No, yeah, they still resummon here. And I'm gonna run out of battle rage, right? I don't have enough. Only have two colors. I need one more hit though. Never mind, it was enough. 50 cold, so our DPS was lacking. We did 62 to 72 per hit though. Crit was still only at 40. So Brass Knuckles, even though it's like the easiest, simplest way to get crit, it's still kind of slow. Um, I think... The mask is probably still better if you find hawk runes to put into the sword. How much did I heal with the red gems, by the way? I kind of want to see. We did almost 600 damage. We healed 142 and 142. Okay, that's a uh, pretty good survival. I'm still very healthy as well. Like, once we hit battle rage, we just took no damage because of our, our armor, shred. And then all the healing on top. But, um... Yeah, this was fun. This was, uh... <laughs> My attempt with Buster Blade.